Okay, awesome. So that's our sketch done. Now what we're going to do is some shading. All right, now this is really fun. If you've got um, a 6B pencil or a 4B, that's that, um, that little number on the bottom there, um, that means that that's a really soft pencil, okay? So that's great for doing um, shade, things like shading. All right, um, so we're going to just go ahead and use that. And if you don't have one of them, you can use any old pencil that you've got. That's fine. And what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to start off with some of the, the middle tones, okay? So some of the kind of grays. So how I do it is I hold it really on its side, okay? And lightly put in a bit of shading, just really lightly. Okay, now see how this whole part of the ear here is a little bit darker? That side part of the ear. Put in a bit of shading, and then, this is the funnest part, guys, use your finger, give it a smudge. Give it a smudgy smudge. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look how soft that is. Pretty cool. Okay. So, keep keep adding pencil in and um, doing some smudging here. Awesome guys, you're doing really well so far. So add a bit more pencil, and then do a bit more smudging. Now it's a bit lighter on this side of the head, eh? So we'll just add a, a little bit of pencil, not too much. Except for that dark space there on the side. So what I'm doing here is I'm just looking at the picture, and I'm just trying to copy what I can see over here. The light's coming from this side, isn't it? This direction. So that means this whole side of the head is pretty dark. So I'm just going to go like this. Add in some darker tones around here. See how there's a, by our dark, but by the eyes, there's actually a light patch underneath. Okay, so leave, leave that there. Try not to smudge over that bit if you can help it. Cool. Um, now, don't do the dark bits until the end, okay? So that's the that's the best plan, because it's tempting to want to just do all the dark bits at the start. But we want to try and just do the soft tones first. Now, do you see how half of the, the, the cat's nose is a little bit darker and half of it's lighter? So you just put a bit of tone, a bit of shading on there, smudge it in. Put a little bit on, smudge it in. In fact, if you smudge around, you've probably got some pencil already on your paper, so you can just smudge it around. And don't forget our little light patch under the eye. And then it's darker around here. Cool. Now remember, if I'm going a bit too fast, you can just pause it and catch up. There we go, guys. Cool. It's already looking so cool. Hopefully your one looks cool as well. There's a little bit of shadow here under the mouth bit, isn't there? Okay. Yes. Nice. Good work. Good one. Okay. Now. Now's the fun part. Okay, so let's do some of the dark shading. So on the head, see how there's these cool stripes? So there's like a stripe going up here. And all I'm doing here, guys, is I'm just pressing a bit harder with my um, 6B. And I probably don't need to smudge this much now because it's already got some nice soft gray tones behind it. Um, now I can just kind of add in the dark tones like this. This is where we can do like the bit around the eye. Don't do the inside of the eye yet. Just leave that till the, till the end. Oh, drawing's so much fun. I love drawing. Hopefully you guys like drawing too. Okay, now don't do the nose or the eyes yet, okay? Apart from the bit around the eyes. Because we're going to use a sharper pencil, and I'll show you why in a minute. All right, where else is it darker? There's sort of some darker patches in here. 
Well, it's really dark along that side of the ear there, isn't there? Just notice how dark that was. Because that's on the sort of shadowy side of the animal. Cool. Alright, I'm pretty happy with how this is coming out, guys. It's looking good. Is your one looking alright? 